Aquarius, welcome to your weekly reading. This is going to be for the sign of Aquarius. It's not going to resonate with all of you out there. This is also not Sun, Moon, or Venus sign specific. Any Aquarius placement you resonate with. Some of the messages may also resonate. Personal reading information, any jewelry seen, all will be linked and listed. We'll pull oracles at the end, give you a little bit more guidance for the week. Otherwise, Aquarius, we're jumping right in. I do only take jumpers, so I appreciate your patience in advance. First card out with the, was the Nine of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles. Air si um, Earth sign energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo could be important to you. We also have Major Arcana for your sign, the Star card, Aquarius energy, followed by the Page of Wands, Sagittarius energy, the Four of Wands, the Four of Swords, Two Fours, and Major Arcana, the Hierophant, Taurus energy. So more um, Earth energy. Bottom of the deck is the Page of Pentacles. Something new here. Something new is happening. Page of Wands, Page of Sword, Page of Pentacles. Sorry, I do get there is some sort of new opportunity idea. Also, could be some sort of good news coming in that is enable that is letting you know that something new is finally ready to be started. But this is also a card of admiration. The way he it just looks at this pentacle, like he's just so enamored. This could be how someone feels towards you. This could be how you feel towards person, place, or thing. Maybe you're studying something new. You have a new hobby. You have a new interest, and it's really taking you. You know, it's really like got you into it. Lots of stability here. Lots of protection as well with the two fours. You could be seeing fours a lot. 44 could be significant to you. Two major arcanas, Aquarius and Taurus energy. Something something big is about to happen here. Something is about to come into alignment. Either you're going to be committing to something, someone or something is committing to you. Whoever this is has been doing a lot of thinking about this with the four of swords, a lot of meditation, reflection. Um, it could also be a break card. But with these two, these are both healing cards as well. So definitely a lot of healing, a healing situation, a healing outcome or message even with the Page of Wands as good news. Something has taken a while though. The Knight of Pentacles, very slow uh, moving energy, someone that doesn't jump into things. They really like to know what they're getting into before they commit or make any sort of final decisions. Um, but definitely someone that likes to have solidity, like have um, stableness in their life. Someone that is slow to commit because they like to make sure that they're, you know, doing the right thing, but very much someone that is into commitment and likes to grow things. Four of Wands is stability. Could be doing something to do with the home. But there is some sort of uh, milestone here. Moving in, uh, living together, marriage that is being contemplated heavy by someone here. Masculine energy too. A lot of masculine energy. With the Hierophant here, this is definitely some sort of commitment. Either that you're making or someone is really thinking deeply about making to you. Or a situation involving you. Could be a project involving you. As the Pentacles here could be something to do with income. But it looks like the thinking has come to... Whoever's thinking has come to a conclusion. They're realizing that this is a big deal. It may seem like, you know, on the surface they're thinking about it, but they're really thinking about it. They, they are seeing this as something that's a very big deal. I do get a bit of wish fulfillment with that star card energy as well. Idealist, I idealism. And I do think that there's a conclusion made, and I think the conclusion made that, yes, this is something I, uh, I, I want to move forward with. This is something I want to commit to. This is something I want to stabilize. I'm finally ready to take the plunge. I'm finally ready to make the decision. Could be some sort of proposal here. We have Major Arcana, the um, Scorpio card, Death card underneath the deck, Transformation. Something's getting ready to transform for the better. High Priestess, but I think you already know this. Major Arcana, Pisces energy, the letter B and J could be important to you. I think you already know something's going on. And I think you're right, yeah. Evolution here, going from the Knight of Pentacles to the King of Pentacles. Someone's definitely ready to sort of um, plant roots. Victory, very much looking like ceremony or a rep reception, especially with this. Let's get some oracles. Guidance for Aquarius, please. You could be dealing with a Taurus, a Pisces, a Scorpio, Sagittarius, heavy on the earth sign. But I do see someone is realizing they're ready to commit here. They're ready to official, officialize something. 
Surrender to the Divine. Yeah. Yeah, they're ready. They are definitely ready. Maybe by the next full moon, something significant will be happening. Some sort of proposal. But whatever this is, this person is realizing whatever this change is for the best. This change is absolutely is for the best. It's for their greatest interest. It's the best thing they could do for themselves, the two of you. And there's victory. There is overcoming. Very much giving reception after wedding vibes. Time to give rather than take. We are in Virgo season. So this is definitely happening now for whoever this is um, resonating for. This is a love situation for Aquarius. So if you have been kind of feeling that someone is maybe getting ready to take things to the next level, they are. You guys may have also a um, telepathic connection, but you are very intuitive. Whatever your intuition is speaking to or telling you about the situation, you're right. They are getting ready to sort of um, make things more real or make things more stable and solid or permanent. Guidance here. We have worth waiting for. <laughs> Divine timing is at work in your love life. Yeah, that's cute. That is cute. So whatever this is, it is worth waiting for. It has been worth waiting for. I do think more so it's on this person's behalf of who's been doing the thinking. They've been sort of waiting. And I think they're realizing now is the time. Now is the time to move forward from that very slow energy to a very much ready to move forward energy. The Wheel of Fortune is also moving forward. They admire you. They want to start, begin, maybe also have children with all this um, page energy. For those of you where that applies, one card flipped over. Let's see. Armadillo Spirit, set healthy boundaries, number three. Definitely something is in alignment here with that three energy. And that set healthy boundaries, I do believe this person has um, this whole slow moving, making sure that it's the right one. I think this was a good thing to do. And they're realizing they don't need to do that anymore. It's, it's, it's uh, perfectly... It's beneficial to move forward. They've they've been moving slow enough. They've seen what they need to see. Time to heal. Five five energy. So you have four four five five. Lots of healing with both the star card and the four of swords. Let's get uh, one of these for you, Aquarius. Guidance for Aquarius, please. Lots of lots of major arcana too. The init the initiation rite of passage crossing the threshold. <laughs> If some of you aren't getting married, I tell you, because isn't that like a traditional thing to jump over the broomstick or to cross the threshold? Someone's sure they want to commit. If this is not love, this is definitely someone that you have some sort of business opportunity with. And there has been some hesitation as to whether or not they want to fully invest. They're about to put their whole bank account in it. That's how much they believe in this process. And you do see the maturing here from the page to the knights to the king. Rite of passage. Marriage is definitely a rite of passage. Commitment, partnership, heavy evidences on that, uh, um, elevating in partnership, solidifying commitment, guidance for Aquarius, please. Now is the time. They are ready. They've seen everything they need to see. Change is good. Embrace that shit. Beautiful reading, Aquarius. Beautiful energy. Hopefully this resonates with you. That is your reading. No thumbs me up. Let me know if it resonates. Don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys next week.